13,000 years ago. The great ice sheets were in retreat as the last ice age was coming to an end. The Clovis people, one of the first human inhabitants of North America, roamed the Great Plains alongside giant beasts. A team of archaeologists is investigating the evidence they left in the Sheridan Cave in Ohio, southwest of Lake Erie. Clovis peoples were hunter-gatherers. In other words, they hunted wild game and they gathered wild plant foods. At this time period, there were animals we call the mega mammals, which included large elephant-like creatures such as the woolly mammoth, as well as the American mastodon. Then, suddenly, all evidence of the mega mammals and the weapons used by the Clovis people disappeared. The same observation was made by geologists at other excavation sites across America. Tankersley is convinced a catastrophe drove the mammoths to extinction. And it would have happened in a snap of a finger. Over 30 genera of mega mammals went extinct and the Clovis technology disappeared forever. Clues to what happened came from another part of the cave. It's in a geological formation known as the Black Map Layer. It is a dark line of rock packed with charred debris, and it suggests a violent death. The Black Layer, which you see in this profile, is carbon, a high organic content and what we're seeing is the remains of animals which were living at that time, which literally had the flesh burned off their bones. In order to do that, we're talking about somewhere between 500 and 1200 degrees Fahrenheit. The cause of the inferno has long been a mystery, but deep in these Ohio caves, Tankersley thinks he has found traces for an asteroid impact. This is what's known as a magnetic susceptibility meter. It looks as if the degree of magnetism of the layers of the sediments. If we take a reading in the layer that predates the asteroid or comet strike, so when we look at the reading, it's somewhere around 70. If we compare that at the black map, where we're finding micrometeorites, we're looking at 50 times the magnetism of the layer before we have evidence of an asteroid or a large comet. Like at Meteor Crater in Arizona, Tankersley believes the asteroid brought in large amounts of iron, causing a strong magnetic field. As the asteroid entered the atmosphere, it burst into thousands of smaller micrometeorites. He believes that the impact annihilated the mega mammals and brought the Clovis people to the edge of extinction. Skeptics within the scientific community doubt the theory. They think the devastation could have been caused by lightning or a wildfire started by the Clovis people themselves. Bullshit. But recently, further evidence for the destructive power of these killer rocks has been uncovered. <laughs> Alexa, turn the tusk red.